guys, this is Xavier with Gotta Be Mobile. I'm with Sasha from Mobile Geeks. We're at Tech World 2016 with Lenovo, and this is the world's first Tango device. Sasha's an old friend, I've known them for almost 10 years, and wow, mobile devices have come a long way since we started in this business. I know. So It's not called Project Tango anymore. The project, it's over, it's a real thing. It's no, just it's Tango. Tango. So right. people will start seeing this branding from Google and their partners. Yeah. What are you most excited about Tango, and can you give a brief overview of what it is and what it means to the consumer? But I'm super excited that augmented reality is now finally getting into the mass market. But it takes a company like a premium OEM to do that. And we've been talking about this for ages. We've been actually talking about Project Tango for three years right now. And finally, as I said, you know what? Now it is a real thing. It is Tango. And I mean, it's all about the software, it's all about the content. It's the same as virtual reality, right? Um, you can get all these fancy headsets right now, but if you don't have the real content behind this, then it might be the end of this hype, especially after you've invested like two or two and a half thousand dollars into a virtual reality setup. This is $499, and the cool thing is that Lenovo um, partnered with a bunch of content producers, like for example, you have this Lowe's uh, Vision on here. You can you can go shopping and just, you know, put all this furniture into your living room or wherever in your home. And I think this is really cool because for the very first time, users can actually realize and try out what augmented reality really means. Once again, you need a device that is also quite appealing when it comes to the pricing. And I think $499 for a Project Tango, geez, I said it again, a Tango device like the Noble Fab 2 Pro um, is pretty awesome. Once again, we have to wait for the content. Yes, they have from six, seven apps on here. Um, this should just be the very, very beginning of this. They need content for this, because otherwise people won't use it.